happening so the month of april just flew by like i cannot believe that we are already in may and this is my birthday month yes my birthday is on the 18th of may and i am turning 25 I know that's a big number, right? But it's okay. I'm turning 25. I'm happy. It's my birthday. That's what I'm concerned about. But anyway, Chui is pretty excited to share this video because it's an April favorites video, and I know how much you guys love my favorites video. One of the most important things that I have been craving for in April is to watch a good TV show. Like. Name it, and I have seen it all. Be it your Game of Game of Thrones, Full House, Fuller House, whatever it might be. I'm done watching all my shows. So what I would suggest is that why don't you guys suggest some shows that I should probably watch, and then in my May favorites, I could probably include that. Hmm? Let me know. Okay, coming to the products, I have few things here right now with me, and the first thing that I have with me is my Victoria's Secret Bombshell Mist. Oh my God, I love this. The only thing I could pray and wish for is that Victoria's Secret was in India, especially in Mumbai. But unfortunately, we do not have it, and I had to request a friend of mine from UK to actually send this to me. And since he was coming down with another friend, he got this for me, and I love this one. Okay, uh, next thing that I have with me right now is another product by Forest Essentials. I think you guys are going to hear Forest Essentials. till the time i film videos i think eternity that could be but anyways um this is my face wash uh, which is a delicate facial cleanser in kashmiri saffron and neem this is my second purchase and i absolutely love this face wash it's gentle it's delicate it's really working well for my skin and i can see some great difference so i highly recommend this product to each one of you who have combination to oily skin this one is a keep up Next I have with me is a makeup product. Um this is actually a contour highlight and a blush palette from this brand called Revolution. This one's pretty old and I just happened to discover this in my wardrobe. I think this is such a go-to, you know, your blush contour and highlight kit. You really don't need to carry three separate products. All you need is just this one out here. But this is like my go-to thing where whenever I'm going out or when I'm shooting or you know just traveling here and there, this one It's perfect. Next, I have with me right now this really cute thing that I picked up from Sephora. But I got this from Sephora Pune. You must have seen in my birthday vlog when I turned 24 last year. This is a really cute mini pet floral uh, hand cream or lotion. You can call it. I think this is what it is, and it smells really nice. Now I like to carry a hand cream with me or a hand lotion with me at all points because I tend to like dry my palms really quick and that's weird like I have oily skin but my palms and my hands get super dry even if it is summer so I don't necessarily carry this only during winters I have this little thing out here with me even during summers and it's cute it looks great it's pink and the best part is that it does the job just right Okay Next I have with me um is this product by Be Blunt. This is their Back to Life dry shampoo. Uh it's a mini size so I think you guys know why I have this with me because my hair tends to get really flat like it falls most of the times flat and I always you know have to work upon the volume and the bounce bit of it. This is a dry shampoo from Be Blunt that I use whenever ha I have like a greasy oily scalp going on out right here. This is the product that I use and the whole of April I have literally been using this product almost every second day because I have no time I've been running back to back for events and shoots and sometimes I cannot like invest an hour into washing my hair so this product comes just handy Next I have with me is my favorite EOS lip balm. Oh my god, I love these Purical lip balms from EOS and being a lipstick as well as a lip balm freak and addict, I have like 6 of these. Literally 6 of these. But uh, the lemon one is something that I have opened and I have been using all throughout like April. It's been keeping my lips hydrated and moisturized and I absolutely love it. Plus it's yellow. Yellow is like one of my favorite colors, so it's cute. Next I have with me is the Sivana 3D eyebrow pencil. I have been a huge 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 fan of like doing my eyebrows and making them look all great and well done up because I have realized that eyebrows can make such a whole lot of a difference on your face. It just adds like definition, it chisels you out and you look great. So for people out there who are not doing their eyebrows, please take the suggestion and start doing your brows. Um this is a Sivana 3D colors eyebrow pencil. I like this one because it has a pencil you know so you can just sort of line your eyebrows it also has a powder filler that is used to sort of fill in your brows 
and the last thing that it has is that it has like this mascara kind of a wand but you have to use it on your brows to sort of just shape them and it just stays in place without moving so i really like this product i have one of my favorite lipsticks from maybelline this is um 275 crazy for coffee um look at the color I don't have to say anything. Just look at the color. This is a beautiful coffee nudish color. It's something that I'm also wearing on my lips right now, so this becomes like a quick swatch for you guys. But yeah, I really like this lipstick. It's amazing and it's just perfect for day to day to day basis. And if you're going to office, I think this is the color that you should wear because you know, just a quick tip: if you're going to office, you really shouldn't wear like a red or a pink or any color like that. Try opting for new. in browns and i think this shade out here is just great in fact you can just wear it even at night if you're looking for like you know a smoky eye look for your eyes and like nude lips and just a little bit of gloss and you're good to go plus the best part about maybelline lipsticks are that they're really affordable and easily available so yay okay guys that is it for the month of april these are the few products that i have used tried and loved in the month of april do let me know your suggestions in the comments box below also please recommend me a show that i can watch april just gone by and i have literally been doing nothing but just chilling on netflix because i've seen almost everything but yeah that's it for now give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and see you in my next video bye